Hi guys and welcome to another one of my Napoleon Total War online battles. I'm playing as France um, against a fan of Total War, otherwise known as uh, Comedy Around the Corner on YouTube. I'll put a link to his YouTube channel in the description for you. And uh, he's also playing as France. And you just saw my uh, lancers get crushed as they went into an old guard square while trying to chase off his horse artillery. But I think I've done the job cannons have been left there and that's what I needed to do Lancers forming back up over here you'll see my army build popping up on screen now and around about now should be a fan of total wars uh, anyway on my right flank charge my uh, Lancers in to the 6th regiment infantry I think they're the uh, they double up as the light infantry units. Uh, meanwhile, he's pulling over his lancers, chasseurs, and guard chasseurs to combat my uh, lancers. But I've done the damage I wanted to do with them, I've taken out his artillery. As always, I've brought my howitzers, which are forming up over here, and I'm uh, going to fire onto the cavalry. I don't know what these horses are doing. Doing a bit of crazy stuff going on there. How it's just happily firing away there. Always if you can fire on a... Oh, I don't know what they were happily firing on there. I think they were cavalry but they moved off. Obviously uh, how it's are way more effective against cavalry than they are against... Our infantry. men are running, sir! Our men are running apparently. Uh, anyway, so... My Lancers got caught up here. I was trying to bring this unit around to take out his general staff but they got caught up by his lancers and uh, guard ch chasseurs. His men are forming up around there but I have sort of near enough cleared out the uh, right flank there. What he's got left are a mixture of Polish legion, guard seamen and grenadiers of the line and the brave. Also at the back here we've got national guard unit of uh, militia do you believe. Chuck the extra cash on them. Anyway, over here, his general staff charges in. Um, I'm guessing to catch up with my routing units. And meanwhile, I decide to move forward. I don't know. Oh, I don't know why they formed up. Well, I was showing they were forming up in column there. So, anyway, here, are my guys. Cannons moving forward as well. Again, using that same old build of a. Uh, Three old guard, putting them on my flanks to um, really do some damage, and they can basically start a whole route uh, flanking movement going on from that. If I haven't already said, I'm going to apologise for um, not having a video up lately. I have been getting thoroughly addicted to Battlefield Bad Company 2, which, if you haven't played, I suggest you do. It's awesome. Um, and yeah, just general chilling out and also I've been pretty lazy and just couldn't be asked to do one if I'm honest but I'm getting this video up I'll get another one up as well shortly you guys all know about the situation with my Scottish campaign will start very shortly um, hoping the Peninsula campaign will come out before the week's out if not Scottish campaign is a go anyway back to this battle my old guard running up here to uh, Add to my flanks. The rest of my fusiliers forming up. Um, but bringing two of them over here so I can form them into square nicely if he decides to charge me with his cavalry, which, judging that he was forming up on the left, I thought that would probably be a safe bet, to be fair. Guard chesters over here. Nice uniforms. forming up and uh, the light infantry unit there that I charged into earlier didn't route it stayed strong and it's now pushing up so I had something stuck in my throat there <laughs> and uh, he's moving forward with his guard seamen Polish Legion and Grendis the line and the brave the rest of his lines also moving up he's just rallied them as well to give them a morale boost 
Um, however, he doesn't actually have a screen of light infantry, so he is going to feel the wrath of my uh, voltiers. And over here, I've pulled some of my light infantry round the voltiers. I probably should have told them to put stakes in, um, but I don't tend to like doing that because it then uh, basically says to your opponent, "Don't attack here. Look what I've got." So I pretend I uh, prefer to put them up at the last minute if I can, or I don't bother with them at all. So my cannon's still firing. Lovely explosions going on in there. That's it. How it's gone, that aren't as effective against line infantry as they are against cavalry because they do decimate cavalry, but they are obviously still effective. And carefully placed one on the flanks can really help to cause a, a mass route and I've also been aiming for the general staff which is what I was going for and he's, there he is hello um, so he needs to die at some point cannon's still raining down hell uh, really lowering the morale here which is which is good so anyway my, I've got my old guard um, moving forward here just a tiny bit so they can be in range as well and hopefully fire uh, meanwhile uh, he's seen that I've formed up on my right so he can't attack there so he's moving his cavalry around to the left flank and in turn I can now spread out my fusiliers at the line. I've got to be careful though because there's an old guard up there which will eat these guys but um, keeping them strong. Got my general's bodyguard here I've got my howitzers again to continue to fire into the centre here. Um, normally I would say obviously fire on the flanks and chip away at one side because then you can create a flanking move on that side and basically crumble the whole line near enough but um, this is basically, they were firing on those because I had told them to fire on the general and they'd been firing short. Um, but again, as you see, that unit's just routed Grind is the line. That unit's not going to last too much longer with the old guard firing superbly in there. Lovely body going on there. Got a bit of elevation, so they're firing. Some good, good shots in there, and I've just routed basically that whole unit there. Let's move up with this National Guard. <laughs> National Guard versus Old Guard. Mm, not a good idea, probably. <laughs> Sir! Got Sir! Our General is under attack! My General's under attack, apparently. Um, yeah, I brought my General over here to rally these guys, because they've got to try and take on the Old Guard. Um, and over on the right... Um, he, oh, not over on the right. Over on my left, his right. He's forming up his cavalry, I'm guessing for a charge on my cannons. So at the last minute I pull my uh, old guard into square to try and stop them. And I also pull across two units, a few units of the line and uh, an old guard unit, sorry. And to try and, and then form them into squares to stop them getting too close to my cannons. They form into square. Our men are running, sir! And see these guys chip down. Probably perhaps lag. This looks epic normally, guys. <laughs> These guys are still firing away. Pulling these guys back into line. They're routed. Over here, I have indeed lost one of my units. Fuses of the line. The old guard are superior troops in almost every way to anything that faces them. And they've just absolutely eaten through that other unit and they're eating through this one. That gives them a chance to move forward with this uh, light infantry unit. Um, uh, off go the Polish guard lancers. Bye guys. So with the rest of my men, I'm gonna pull them around in a nice big arc line like that. Nice angle even, not arc. And so I can start flanking. Our men are running, sir! Howitzers still firing pretty well. Also what you can do with howitzers is um if you let the enemy come to you uh, even closer and obviously pull your line back a bit closer to the howitzers, you don't need to worry about them firing them because they fire in an arc rather than straight through, as normal cannons do. But um, you can then put them into canister shot, and I, I faced um, a couple of people playing it as the Ottoman Empire. I know they've done like a melee unit spam, like the Marathan, Maratha Confederacy unit, uh, melee unit spam from Empire. And um, I obviously formed my men in two flanks on the side. He was walking into a big U shape, and I had my howitzers at one end, firing canister shot right into the middle of them. He got completely decimated. Um, I was going to actually record that one and show it, but the replay um, error when I tried to load it, sadly. 
but it was pretty good. Anyway, I'm moving up here. My fuse is to the line of the line. We have killed their general, sir. Uh, now so they must forward. break. And I have indeed killed their general, which I don't know where he was actually at that point. Oh, his a uh, his a uh, cheeky Polish uh, guard lancers have come back and they're attacking my uh, my howitzers here, stabbing away. Go for the zoom in there, see the action. Where are we going now? We're going on to the next howitzer unit. A glorious victory, sir, is soon to be yours. But as you just heard, a glorious victory is soon to be had. Okay, here we go. Well played, fan of Total War. I hope you guys have enjoyed. As always, please comment, rate, and subscribe, and visit www.todfin.co.uk forward slash gaming.